Good afternoon, it's Dave from CoolPetBugs.com and today I'm going to do a video on a scorpion and the scientific name is Hottentata Hottentata. Uh, some people call it the alligator back scorpion. This particular scorpion is from Africa. It gets to be you know, two, two and a half inches, not very large. I'd say it's you know, maybe mildly aggressive. On the scale, of, on the venom level, scale of up to five, I'd say this is probably about a three. Certainly, you know, it's not going to kill a person. Uh, definitely going to hurt a lot more than, uh, you know, let's say a bee or, or a yellow jacket sting, if you've ever been stung by a yellow jacket. But uh, these ones, what I'm going to kind of show you here, and this is true of all scorpions, is they molt, which means they shed their skin and then that's how they get bigger. And with scorpions, they shed about six to seven times, depending on the species. And this one shedded its skin. I was God, November 29th, but let me, yeah, I'll put it up to the camera. So it just, I mean, it looks like, you know, a, a miniature scorpion. And, you know, it's really has dried out. Yeah, it's been in the cage for quite a while now. But in another, you know, a, a little bit over a month, it'll shed again, and it'll get larger. And until it reaches, I think it's about six for the female and seven for the male. But... Which brings to another point, these scorpions are, are parthenogenic, which means they do not need to mate, they don't need a male and a female to make young. All the ones that you're gonna get in the hobby, like this one, they're female. And it does not, so you don't need another male, this will have babies on its own, which is uh, very strange. Stick, this, you know, stick insects do this, uh, morning geckos do this. But uh, what uh, what I'll do now? I'm just gonna put the pause the video, flip it over, and I'll show you this little guy. These guys are really to care for. Actually, while I have it, yeah, you know what? Let's do that. All right. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the rock out here. As you can see, this uh, hot and data. You can see the setup is real basic. I just use a critter keeper. I have uh, just playground sand uh, as a substrate, and I keep this on a heat mat. And I have a, a big enclosure downstairs where I keep all my scorpions. And then just a real simple uh, Gatorade cap for a water bottle, and this is how I fill it. I just take a, put the end, bring it over, you know, release this end, and it just drops in. I'm sorry for the poor camera work, and then I'll, I'll get to the scorpion. Yeah, and so this this one here, you'll get to, you know just a little bit, a little bit bigger. But I can't wait till it starts to, uh, you know, produce young. But with that said, you know, I, I this one was about thirty dollars is, is is what I spent for it. But once it starts, you know, breeding and and. Right now it is, uh, what is it, I think it's December 11th, I, I'm not even certain, but uh, I'm hoping by spring or summer 
I should have lots and lots of baby scorplings, is what they call them. Because I'll have, uh, I've heard uh, up to 30, 30 babies at a time. And then that, that, that could happen every uh, three months. Let's see if I get better light in here over. A little bit better view. And scorpions, they'll hide all day long. I mean, obviously he's looking, looking for shelter. But I want to show you as well what I feed them. I just feed small pinhead crickets. So I'll, I'll put one in there. I, I highly doubt he's going to eat. He's kind of freaked out. But just to show you the size. So I, that just a small pinhead cricket, and he will eat. You know, one of those. I would say every other day. And it's daytime, so he's a little freaked out now. But I wouldn't expect him to eat. But you never know. No. But yeah, real, real simple, real simple enclosure. I'll put this back. But they like it hot. You know, you, you want to keep it. I keep the cage. It's about 80 degrees during the day. And it, it does drop up, drop down to about 70 at night, which is fine. But yeah, this is the hot and tata, hot and tata. Please, uh, if you have any questions, comments, leave that below. Please subscribe to my channel and uh, make it a great day.